All right, Tina. So one of the things that I see that you should try to work on is, is really trying to stay more level with your shoulders throughout the entire course. You do a pretty good job behind the boat. Everything looks great. As you come out to this uh, pre-turn and you're starting to make that turn, you're allowing that inside shoulder to fall in way too far. So during that reach, you want to find a way to keep that uh, connection a little bit tighter with the outside arm, in this case the right arm, so that as you reach you can stay more upright and you can be more level with the head and that inside shoulder would be more upright and then you would get the hip to move a little bit more inside of that turning arc and that would allow that ski to roll over and actually get you a lot tighter turns. So you can see here how that whole head and that shoulders drop to the inside of that turn. So we want to find a way to stay more level and you do a better job coming into this side right here. You're, you're a bit more upright, your head's more up, that inside shoulder is taller and this, this looks better. So it's right about from here to there where you really lose it. So as you go into that reach, you're reaching and letting those, those elbows and those wrists come too far out away from that body and so that boat has too much control over the upper body and starts to pull it in. So you need to find a way to, to keep that tighter longer on the way out so that as you do release you can stay more upright and have the head up, that inside shoulder up and you can start to engage that inside that left hip more into that turn.